Cupid, still up to your old tricks, I see. Ah, Athena, uh, good, good to see you. Yes, uh, well, uh, sometimes not love needs a little help. Love, a sweet old-fashioned notion. So, what's the alternative? I've been working on that. I've developed a flowchart to aid mortals in making wise and logical decisions regarding matters of love. Very nice. Yes, uh, I think you should show this to the young woman. Excuse me, miss, but I could not help but notice this young man here seems to have an amorous intent toward your person. Before you make any decisions regarding this, I thought you should look at this. You were talking to that creep that's been staring at me all night. Oh, don't worry about him. He was planning to eject you with the amnesiac, but I stopped him. But I really would like you to look at this. So, you plan to inject me with some sort of love potion, and of course, as you think you are the most attractive man here, you naturally assumed that I would lust after you. You think you are a gift to women? Some sort of Greek god? Why, uh, yes, yes I am. Um, well, most people don't catch that. Well, actually, my Greek name is Eros. Uh, about any story about that, you, you see, you wouldn't... I've heard enough. You can't hurt my little cherub. You, you care about me. I've always cared about you, Cupid. Let's get out of here. I think these mortals are a bad influence on us.